Hey, how's it going guys? Derek here from Addictive Tips. So in this video here, we're going to be talking about how to go and install Overwatch on Linux. So I'm going to briefly show you this bit of the tutorial because this is kind of important. So what you need to do is you need to make sure that you have the latest version of Wine, the Wine staging. In the tutorial, if you go to the link in the description, you can get it for all of these different distributions. Once that's taken care of, you need to open up the Wine config. So that's Wine CFG, and I'll launch that. Just make sure that, uh, click on the staging tab and make sure both of these are set. Then you can click OK to close it. Then you go back to the tutorial, of course, and just download Battle.net. Now, I already have Battle.net installed and the game downloaded because it's a very large game, but uh, just scroll down and download this, and uh, it should open up in Wine. Just right-click on this here, click on Wine Windows Program Loader, and uh, install it. Now I already have, like I said, I already have Battle.net installed, so I'm not gonna do this installer, but that's how it works. So once you've got all that ready, you can pretty much just open up Battle.net and sign in, and we'll take it from here. So I'm gonna log into my account, and uh, from there I can just locate Overwatch on the side, and then I can click the play button, and it should launch in Linux just fine, as long as we have our settings set correctly. And as we can see, Overwatch is running just perfectly on, on Linux. There are going to be some frame rate problems that you'll see, but uh, it's not, you know, it, it's not like it's uh, game breaking. Uh, I also have a lot of stuff running in the background as I'm recording. And uh, let's quickly load a game just so you can see that yes, this is indeed true. And yes, it does indeed work. Wine has really come a long way. So we can see I'm loaded in the game. and it is playable. What I would recommend is uh, if you're going to play Overwatch on Linux, do not also run like three VMs in the background and have lots of other tabs open. But uh, yeah, this is how it works. And uh, if you're interested in more, please check the link to the description. It's a link to my tutorial on how to get this working and it will go over everything in detail. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoy, enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one.